Hi Pinks, how you doing? Let me know in the comments below. Oh! Today we're gonna get some cool free items, so I really think you should stick around until the end. But first, I bet you can't like and subscribe before Lilac says go. 3, 2, 1, go. <laughs> To get this new Sanrio free item, you first have to join a low kitty cafe. Click here to see all of the tasks you need to complete to get the new item. To complete the first task, you have to buy the 50th anniversary cafe skin, and you can do that over here. It costs 2500 pink diamonds. To complete the next task, you have to collect 3000 pink diamonds during the event. You can get diamonds by completing tasks and opening chests in the city. Finally, to complete the last task, you have to enter the 50th anniversary party room. To fully complete this, you have to watch these two videos. But, this will be a continuation from that last video. Follow me to the room with the sand. Now collect the apple, and as you can see, we need one more apple to get to 10 apples. You might only be at 8, but that's okay. Follow me. Now, complete both of these in these paintings, and you should get an apple from each. Once you reach 10 apples, go to this room. Finish the obby. and collect the rainbow keycard. Now use that card to open up the party room, and you're done. After you complete all of the tasks you should be able to claim the free item. Do you like it? Let me know below. Firstly, join this game, Hello Kitty Cafe. Yes, they finally updates the game and the previous free limited UGC is no longer available. But, they did finally release the new UGC, so here's how you can get it. First, click this icon so you can see what tasks you need to complete. First you need to collect 3000 pink diamonds during the event. To collect pink diamonds, you can complete tasks, main tasks and daily tasks. And you can also teleport to the city and open up chests to see if you'll be lucky enough to get diamonds from them. And you can also spin the wheel. Next, you need to open up door number 8 in the 50th anniversary mystery museum. To do that, follow me. Also I just want to remind you guys that I opened up the first 5 doors in this video, so if you need a tutorial on how to open up those doors, I will link that video below. Anyway, here's how you can open up doors 6, 7, and 8.
Once you open up door number 8, you can just leave the game and rejoin, then claim the free item. Do you like it? Let me know below. Firstly, join this game, Hello Kitty Cafe. Yes, the update is finally here, and just like you guys guessed, we got new free UGC. Once you join the game, come over here and press this button, and as you can see, you need to complete two things to get the free item. Firstly, you need to open door number 5 and the Anniversary Mystery Museum. To do that, follow me. To open the doors, you need to collect these keycards, and you need to collect these items as well. Follow me and do what I do, and I'll show you how to get to door number 5. Once you open door number 5, you can just leave the game and rejoin, and now as you can see, the first quest is completed. Now, to do the second quest, you just need to collect 2000 diamonds during the event. You can get pink diamonds by opening chests in the city, completing tasks, and spinning this wheel. Complete those two quests, and then you should be able to claim the free item. Do you like it? Let me know below. Firstly, join this game, UGC don't move. To get the hair, you need 45 wins. As always, to get wins, this timer all the way at the top has to go all the way down to zero. The stock is 1250, and 484 have been claimed, so go get yours now. To get this hair, you should first join this group. Then, join this game, Beat Galaxy. Then, press this button that says for UGC. As you can see, to get the hair, you need 200 points. To get points, you have to spin this wheel, and you can only spin this wheel if you join the group and like the game. You can also gain points by playing this game called Young Blood, Low Life. Collect the notes and avoid the obstacles. Every time you play, you will get points. Once you get 200 points, you should be able to claim the free hair. Do you like it? Let me know below. Firstly, join this game, Walmart Discovered. Once you're in, press this Walmart icon, go to quests. Then go to the free UGC tab, and as you can see, to get the item, you have to play your three favorite experiences from the indie shelves for 10 minutes each. To do that, follow me. As you can see, there's three games here. Just play each game for 10 minutes each, and you should be able to claim the item. Do you like it? Let me know below. Firstly, join this game, Cameraman Race Simulator. Now, click this button right here, so you can see the tasks you need to complete, in order to claim the free UGC. So you need to play the game for 4 hours, and hatch 3999 eggs. To hatch eggs, you need to come over here and as you can see, the cheapest egg is 25 trophies. So to get trophies, you have to come over here and run. Just run. But to go faster, you have to click whenever it says click up here. So basically you click, then run, and then once you have at least 25 trophies, you can hatch eggs. Hatch 3999 eggs and play for 4 hours to claim the free item. Do you like it? Let me know below. Firstly, join this game. To get the item, you need to have at least one win. To get a win, come over to this bridge, and make it to the end. 
Make sure you only step on the correct tiles so you won't fall down. If you make it to the end, you'll get a win. Then you can press this button that says UGC, and buy the item for free. Do you like it? Let me know below. Firstly, join this game, Impossible Glass Bridge Obby. To get the free item, you have to make it to the end. If you step on the wrong tiles, you will fall down and you will be forced to start back over. But, if you make it to the end, you will have one win, and you can use that win to claim the free item. To claim the free item, press this button. And buy it for zero robux. Do you like it? Let me know below. Firstly, join this game, Mining Battle Simulator. To get the item, you have to complete three quests, and you can click here to see all of the quests you need to complete to get the item. To complete the first one, you just have to be active in the game for 120 minutes, so that's about 2 hours. If you leave the game, then this timer will reset, so don't disconnect. To complete the next quest, you have to open 500 eggs. To open a starter egg, you need 5 wins. To get a win against the noob, you have to train until you have at least 150 power. Click here to auto train. Once you're at 150, come over here to fight the noob, or you can click here to auto fight it. Beat the noob, and once you have 5 wins, you should be able to open a starter egg. Open 500 eggs to complete the quest. Finally, to complete the last quest, you have to defeat the world 3 boss. To beat the world 2 boss, you need 3000 wins. So keep racking up those wins. Once you get 3000 wins, come over here and buy world 2. And once you teleport to world 2, come over here. And now you need 150,000 wins to get world 3, and complete the quest, so good luck. And once you complete all of the quests, you should be able to claim the item. Do you like it? Let me know below. Firstly, join this game, Fort Blocks. It's basically Fortnite, but in Roblox. To get the item, you need 500 kills. Press this button to join a game, and land by a chest, and hold E to open it, and gather your loot. Once you have a weapon, try your hardest to kill the other people in the server. Once you reach 500 kills, you should be able to claim the free item. Do you like it? Let me know below. As you all know, I made a video a couple of days ago announcing that Hello Kitty Cafe was coming back with some new, free, limited UGC items. Well, the item is finally here. Here's how to get it. Firstly, join the game, then click on this icon. To complete the first quest, you have to use two different photo booths around the map. The first one is located here, near the spawn point. To locate the other one, click up here. Then click this tab, and you can teleport to it. To complete the second quest, you have to use three different emotes. Click this button to find the emotes, and use all three of them. Now. To complete the third quest, you have to collect 4000 diamonds during the event. A good way to get diamonds is by completing tasks, and collecting your rewards. And to complete the final quest, you have to buy the Hello Kitty theme. Come over here to buy it. And as you can see, you need 2500 diamonds, so good luck. Once you complete all of the quests, you should be able to claim the free item. Do you like it? Let me know below. This cute item, you have to join this game. In order to get the UGC item, you have to rebirth 15 times. The first rebirth is $50,000, so here's how you can get your money up. The first thing I suggest you do is complete the obby, and you can teleport to the obby by pressing this button. Now, follow me to complete it.
Once you complete it, you will acquire 2 times spawn rate, which is really useful in this game. The whole objective of the game is to buy food to feed this cat. The food spawns from in here. You can start off by buying this free food, and as you can see, it's coming from out of the factory. The free food is okay, but it barely gives you any money. Every time you feed the cat, you get money, and you need money to rebirth. To feed the cat, come over here by the food spawn, collect your food, then press this button. As you can see, the cat ate the food, and we got some money. But, if you come over here, you can buy more expensive food, and this food is worth buying because it will give you more money when the cat eats it. I bought about 13 of the foods, and this speed boost over here, and I reached $50,000 in about 20 minutes. Once you reach $50,000, you can buy your first rebirth, and then everything will reset, and you have to start over again. And, the rebirth now costs $100,000. So my guess is that it increases $50,000, every rebirth. But anyway, here's how the item looks. So cute, right? It reminds me of my melody. Do you like the item? Let me know below. Firstly, join this game. To get the item, you need to complete all of the three quests. For the first quest, you need to win 300 tournaments. To win tournaments, you need speed. So first I will tell you how to gain speed more faster. If you look up here, you can see how much speed you have, and how much it's increasing, every second. Currently, mine is increasing 7.9k per second. To increase your multiplier, I suggest joining a group, collecting your rewards, and premium players get a 1.5x speed and wins multiplier. Once I do all of that, my speed starts to increase a lot, and I was super fast. So, once you do all of that, you should be able to win tournaments easily. You can stay in the default place and do the easy tournaments. But you won't get a lot of wins, which you need to complete another quest, but that's entirely up to you. And that bring me to the next quest, gain a total of 100 meters speed. For this, I suggest just staying AFK, once you get your speed multiplier as high as you can. And for the last quest, I suggest going through these portals. So you can go and enter harder races and tournaments. The harder the tournament, the more wins you get. For example, this tournament gave me 60 wins every race I won. So, once you finish all of the quests, you should get the free item. Do you like this item? It kind of reminds me of my melody. Let me know your thoughts below. <laughs> Romy event is finally here. To participate, and get a free item, you first have to join this game, Hello Kitty Cafe. Click this icon up here. And you can see all of the tasks you need to complete in order to get the free limited. The first task is to reach level 35. You can do that by taking care of your cafe, serving customers, cleaning up, and things of that sort. The next task is to get the Karomi theme from the cafe themes shop. You can get a new cafe theme by coming over here. And scrolling through all of the themes. And the last two tasks is to collect 5,000 diamonds and 80 gacha tickets during the event. Once you complete all of these tasks, you can claim the free limited. You can get the rest of the Kuromi items by pressing the link below. Do you like it? Let me know below. These two items, you first have to join this game, B Factory. To get the first item, you have to buy it in the game for $650 million, and you can make money in the game by making honey and buying bees. You can come over here to collect honey, then deposit it over here. And you can come over here to buy more bees to ultimately make more honey, which equals more money. But, 
Once you reach 650 million, you can buy the free UGC over here. To get the second free item, you you need to have at least 50,000 bees. I don't know how to exactly check how many bees you have, but good luck. Do you like the items? Let me know below. Oh, wow, so cute. Which Sanrio outfit is your fave? Let me know in the comments below. Firstly, join Hello Kitty Cafe. If you click this icon right here, you can see all of the missions you need to complete, to get the free item. To complete the first mission, you need to buy an item in the city store. To get to the city store, press this map icon at the top, and teleport to the city shop. Now, follow me to the item. As you can see, you can only get the item if you are level 28 or higher. To level up, all you need to do is run your cafe. Serve customers, greet them, and give them their food. To complete the next mission, you need to purchase the Pom Pom Porin theme. To do that, come over here. And as you can see, it costs 2500 diamonds. The only way I know how to get diamonds is by spinning the wheel and completing tasks. You also need to get 4000 diamonds during the event for the next mission, so good luck. And for the last mission, you need to collect 50 gacha tickets. You can get gacha tickets by completing tasks. Once you finish all of the missions, you should be able to claim the free item. Do you like it? Let me know in the comments below. Firstly, join this game. To get the item, you need to complete all of the three quests. For the first quest, you need to win 300 tournaments. To win tournaments, you need speed. So first I will tell you how to gain speed more faster. If you look up here, you can see how much speed you have, and how much it's increasing, every second. Currently, mine is increasing 7.9k per second. To increase your multiplier, I suggest joining their group, collecting your rewards, and premium players get a 1.5x speed and wins multiplier. Once I do all of that, my speed starts to increase a lot, and I was super fast. So, once you do all of that, you should be able to win tournaments easily. You can stay in the default place and do the easy tournaments. But you won't get a lot of wins, which you need to complete another quest, but that's entirely up to you. And that bring me to the next quest, gain a total of 100 meters speed. For this, I suggest just staying AFK, once you get your speed multiplier as high as you can. And for the last quest, I suggest going through these portals. So you can go and enter harder races and tournaments. The harder the tournament, the more wins you get. For example, this tournament gave me 60 wins every race I won. So, once you finish all of the quests, you should get the free item. Do you like this item? It kind of reminds me of my melody. Let me know your thoughts below. Yes you guys, all of these 4 free hairs are real. First up, we have this, got the glaze bonnet hair, ghost edition, by Tropica Fashion. This hair will be available only in game, and it will be released in a game called, Tropica, Avatar and Outfits Catalog Store. As of right now, that is all the details we have about that hair, but if I get any more updates, I will try my hardest to let you all know. Here's how the hair looks. Next, 
We have, Han cut pigtails, black pink, and adorable pink beret Han cut hair. Both of these hairs will be obtainable in a game called Project Mall, but as of right now, the game is still private. And finally, we have these cute pink and blonde fairy curly twirl pigtails. This hair will be available at 7pm GMT, in this game, Avatar Outfit Ideas. To get it, all you have to do is stay in the game for 10 minutes, and the stock is only 3000, so good luck. Which of these hairs are your favorite? Let me know below. Get this cute item, you have to join this game. In order to get the UGC item, you have to rebirth 15 times. The first rebirth is $50,000, so here's how you can get your money up. The first thing I suggest you do is complete the obby, and you can teleport to the obby by pressing this button. Now, follow me to complete it. Once you complete it, you will acquire 2 times spawn rate, which is really useful in this game. The whole objective of the game is to buy food to feed this cat. The food spawns from in here. You can start off by buying this free food, and as you can see, it's coming from out of the factory. The free food is okay, but it barely gives you any money. Every time you feed the cat, you get money, and you need money to rebirth. To feed the cat, come over here by the food spawn, collect your food, then press this button. As you can see, the cat ate the food, and we got some money. But, if you come over here, you can buy more expensive food, and this food is worth buying because it will give you more money when the cat eats it. I bought about 13 of the foods, and this speed boost over here, and I reached $50,000 in about 20 minutes. Once you reach $50,000, you can buy your first rebirth, and then everything will reset, and you have to start over again. And, the rebirth now costs $100,000, so my guess is that it increases $50,000, every rebirth. But anyway, here's how the item looks. So cute, right? It reminds me of my melody. Do you like the item? Let me know below. You guys, this doll bundle is so cute, but it's 70 Robux. Here's a free alternative if you don't want to spend 70 Robux. First, get these two free items, ball jointed doll, and get this free anime eyes head. Now, put on the body from the ball jointed doll bundle, and then put on the anime eyes head. Now, let's watch this TikTok showcasing some pretty outfits to use with the doll plushie bundle, and I'll show you how they look with my free version of the bundle. Now, here are those same outfits with my version of the bundle. Not bad, right? Would you wear this? Let me know below. 